you are given we just can't stop believing we'll see cause in this life anything can hurt you push you then forget you stole my history but i remember me i remember me it don't matter where i go what i'm told now you know i remember me i remember me i start to go by start to cry do or die i remember me i remember me oh yeah what my name is hello this is asia p seriously i'm checking in i saw i know i got a lot of light in the background and i'm jamming to jennifer hudson as you can see my hair is crazy and my face is sweating because i actually did it i'm sweating now more than i have in months maybe even years probably years because i wasn't real real athletic in my youth but these are the chronicles of the curvaceous i don't know what episode i'm on i have to check that but just a little update over the weekend and um what has happened since the last time i made a promise to myself that i would do three days a week um monday wednesday friday monday wednesday friday um that i would at least do an hour or so so i'm taking a break in the middle of my workout today my workout consisted of walking down the hill to abba's house i went to my father's house and when i got there i did about six times on the steps up and down then i came back up the hill and as i walked back up the hill i'm sorry this one's getting to my eye. As I walked back up the hill, I um, came home, cooled down just a bit, and then I got on an exercise bike, and I did that for about 25 minutes. Today, I plan on also um, going to do some strength training, like my arms and stuff like that, and doing squats and arm reps, and really going over the top. My goal um that i'm setting for myself is eight weeks so this chronicle is going to be my eight week journey to losing 20 pounds before my birthday and i will forgive myself if i lose um 16. so 16 to 20 pounds by december 8th today is october the 5th yay so i have just two months and three days and this journey is going to talk about how my emotional struggles, my everything, you know, my high points, my low points, my every kind of points <laughs> during this journey. So um, I feel good. I feel so good by getting up and getting started. This morning I ate breakfast. I ate um, muffin omelets. I've seen a little video on Facebook about how to make them. And I left out a couple of ingredients. But a couple of them I put um, spinach. I put sausage. A little bacon. Cheese. Milk. Spinach. And then I ate grits and um, cheese. That's my main full meal for today. I'm going to start my Shakeology today. And I'm going to have... After at least two week, two hours after my workout, I'm going to have a Shakeology and I'm going to have fruit as my snacks, probably like a canned peaches or some fresh apples, oranges or something like that for my snack. And then um, I don't know what I'm going to have for dinner yet. And that's what I got to work on within the next few weeks, meal prepping, probably starting next week. I was invited to lunch today, but I'm going to call and respectfully decline because I don't want to go back let me tell you about this weekend and then i'm gonna end this little video here um i emotionally ate all weekend because i seen carlton in court on thursday and i started missing him and then the boys at my job kind of got me in a tiff and that just sent me off and i binge ate on Saturday, I ate a full bag of um, Cheetos, like cheese curls by Golden Blake. 
and I ate a whole bag of sweet heat barbecue pork skins and I ate two honey buns a couple of apple pie bites a fish sandwich and some fries and then I ate um, I had star crunches and stuff but I didn't eat them and then yesterday I ate I want to say I ate a honey bun two the same chips in, in um pork rinds I drank a surge a whole can of surge and I drank a Gatorade but today I have drank one bottle of water. I'm going to go back and drink some more as well. But I want you to see me. Full body. See me. And this will be my first time in a while. Let me make the camera full screen so I can see myself in the lens. Because I'm that wide. As I um struggling. Okay. Back recording. So here I am. I'm going to move the camera back just a little bit. Even though the light is there, I have on this um, this full sweatsuit. And I have water everywhere. I'm really sweating like you can feel it. See my arms like water breaking down. And under here, because this is too little, I have on two. Oh, my earring fell. But it's okay. Let's put my hook right here. This is my debit card, but no pocket. I have two because that one won't fit. And then I have this one. And I'm getting out of the camera angle somehow. But step back. And I have this one right here. And let me push this back a little bit. Or maybe up. Yeah, up would be better. So you can see I got on my feet thing right here and I got to take this off to reveal my belly and that's my full stomach to the side view and back 360 get over the camera this is me so that's that a full exposure of what i look like right now but this is just the beginning and every time i forget and get ready to eat those cheetos and stuff i'm gonna come back to this video and remind myself of whatever and i remember me I remember when I had that purple bathing suit on and I was a size 11, 12. And um, me and Zay then went somewhere to like some hotel or whatever. And this dude seen me, honey, and he just wanted me. So I'm going to get back to having a show stop body and have on a bathing suit and have a traffic stopping body. And it won't be long. Have a beautiful face, worked out in makeup. But in the future, I'm going to remember me. And it's going to be a journey. Yeah, I may get upset and sad and all that. And think about these flabby arms and everything. And, and seeing, you know, just how much I've got to go. But I'm going to remember me. And I'm going to do this for me. Well, until then, smooches. I got to go. <laughs>